guys, me, Oak Super Zorro. Thank you very much for tuning in. I've got my Christmas jumper on. Woo, Chewy! Me, Super Zorro's in the car, she's driving. Woo! And we're going shopping. We're crazy. We're going toy shopping, like, two weeks before Christmas. <laughs> uh, we've, we're going to go see the sheeple. I'll queue it up. It's going to be awesome. Sheeple. Because I know they're going to be queuing up at Smith's. It's going to be hilarious. And then... And then we're gonna go to Disney Star, and Sainsbury's, and Game, and Dewey Smith's, and... I don't know what else is open, but we'll see. So guys, I'm gonna bring you guys along, and let's do probably what is gonna be the last toy hunt of 2020. This is probably gonna be it. This is the last time you'll probably see this face in 2020. No, 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 no hang on, not, not this face, see this face daily. Last toy hunt in 2020. This seems I was laughing at my waffledness. <laughs> I'm all hyper this morning, I don't know why. So, I'll see you guys there. In the next too much coffee! I'll see you at the toy store. Bye!
Smiths and uh, the sheeple were in force. I love it. People were queuing up like it was Turbo Man. It was like jingle all the way. It was hilarious. People were queuing up at Smiths, right? There was like 30 people deep. And they all queued up at like 10 minutes before opening to all be let in. And they all froze to death outside. We stayed in our car, lovely and warm, toasty toasty. And basically we got let in at the exact same time as everyone else. <laughs> And one guy said that he's been there since quarter to yeah, nine. Yeah, one guy said he was there since quarter to nine. The store didn't open till half past ten. You lunatic. We all got let in at the same time. We arrived ten minutes before opening and got in. And we were in and out before most people, to be fair. Yes. Insane. Insane mm. in the membrane. So, we're on our way to Disney Store now, so that's going to be a lot of fun. So, uh, we'll see what the queues are like down there. Disney Store's always fun this time of year. Queuing around the store. But luckily I've got my chariot with me. My chariot. So I'll be running fools down. I need to attach some blades to the wheels so I can go full gladiator style. This is just frowning at me. Anyway, guys, let's go on a toy hunt. I'm going to bring you guys along. Let's do this. Let's go to Disney Store. doing breakfast
Super Super Soul. Thank you very much for tuning in. Look what I got! I got some stuff. So you saw that we went shopping this morning. We went out for the first time in about a month. <laughs> that was crazy. It, it was actually a bit crazy out there this morning. You could tell Christmas is coming and people have been locked down for a while. It was like, oh, it was mental. But we're back. And I picked up some stuff. So I'm quite happy with what I got today. So let's take a look inside the bag and see what we got. Let's do this. So first thing I did, I went to GameStop and I picked up a couple of new McFarlane figures that I don't own. So I managed to get my hands on. Mortal Kombat's Baraka. Really like this figure. Um, I missed out on a couple of the early ones, but I can catch up online, hopefully. Um, I think I've missed Raiden, Sub-Zero, Scorpion, and Johnny Cage, I think, so far. Not characters I'm overly fond of, to be honest. That's why I skipped them to begin with. I was never a fan of Sub-Zero and Scorpion. I know that's really controversial to say. I always liked Reptile and Noob and Smoke. So they're my two favourites. So I'm still waiting on my favourite figures to come out as well. I'd love a Sonya Blade. I'd love to see Sonya Blade in this line. And Liu Kang. So I'm waiting for my favourite characters still to come out, really. I'm not a big fan of Johnny Cage. But Baraka, I loved Baraka as a kid. So I finally got my Baraka. Loving that. And of course, I was a big fan of the Mortal Kombat movies from back in the day. So I had to grab myself a katana. Because obviously when I get my Liu Kang, I'm going to want a Katana to go with him. But either way, Katana looked badass, so I had to get Katana. Um, I think these are relatively new in the line. I don't think these are that old. Uh, but I managed to get these from GameStar. $22.99. Bargain. Happy with that. McFarlane's figures. 22 moving point points of articulation. And these are official NetherRealm Studios figures from McFarlane. So happy again. Not two nice figures. Can't wait to see what else they bring to the Mortal Kombat line in the future. That's definitely a line I'm going to continue with. Plan is, I'm going to do both figures in one video, so every time I buy Mortal Kombat figures, I'm going to buy two, because the, usually they release them in sets of two, from what I've noticed. So, I'm going to do it so it's like, Baraka versus Katana, and then next time it might be Sub-Zero versus Scorpion. So if you guys want to see those videos and want to see more from the Mortal Kombat series, then definitely, definitely give those videos thumbs up and give them a watch. Because I only, I only continue the lines uh, for review if you guys watch them and enjoy them so definitely if you're gonna if you want to see more of that line you have to give the video a watch for me right next up in the bag oh because it's Christmas Mrs. Soup Sarl picked us up some new COVID mask protection um, these are the Disney Star ones um, quite expensive actually 20 quid 20 quid yeah, but it's 20 quid! Four of them, though, for 20 quid. Jesus Christ. These are Disney ones. Uh, there's Gingerbread Man and all sorts in there, apparently. So we've got some Christmassy masks for when we go out shopping this Christmas. Are we going to go out again? I don't know. <laughs> I paid for them as well. Damn you. <laughs> and next up. I wonder why that bill gets so much. My toys didn't cost that much. It's wedged. No, I've got him. He's free. Ah, stuck on the bag. Stupid Disney stuff. Help me. Yeah. We got Mando. We got the big talking Mando. Twelve points of articulation. Um, and as well, it's the talking version. It's got loads of different buttons to press and things. So can't wait to have a full play around with this and see all the different. Uh, things he's got a uh, try me up here somewhere. Ooh, so he fires his gun there, and we've got the talking. I did what I had to. I know the drill. I can bring you in warm, or I can bring you in cold. <laughs> no droids. Awesome. So I've got me a talking Mando. Can't wait to review that. Proper Talking Mando. I'll be reviewing this tomorrow because I'm so excited to review it and tomorrow is Mando Monday. So Mando will be getting a full review tomorrow. So stay tuned for Mando Monday. And then guys, last item, last chance. What did we get? Something a little bit different, but I'm happy. We got Talking Alien! Mr. Portal awaits. I couldn't resist. I had to get me a talking alien. 
So, full review of The Talking Alien will be coming very soon as well to the channel, so stay tuned for that. So we got a Mando, Talking Mando and a Talking Alien to review. Sounds daft, I'm happy with it, I love those things. Um, you haven't seen around the top of my room for a while. I've got the talking Boba Fett and Kylo Ren from the previous mo like previous releases. So Mandalorian is going to be up there. I'm going to sell on the talking Kylo Ren. I'm going to sell him because I want to put Mando in his place next to Boba Fett. And then, of course, I'm going to find some room up there somewhere for Alien to sit. Alien may have to go up near Yoda. But yeah, I love my little talking toys. I think they're very funny. And as well, if you noticed the other day, the talking Yoda video, the little baby Yoda and stuff, you guys enjoyed them, so I enjoy making these silly little videos. It's what keeps my channel going. I love doing that, doing action figures, but every so often it's nice to be silly. And silly is fun. <laughs> so a full review of that going real soon. Guys, what are your thoughts on this video? Let me know in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure you hit that subscribe button. Subscribing really supports us. It really helps out. It helps us to keep making awesome videos. Thank you very much for watching. As always, I'm your host, Super Sorrel, and I'll see you in the next video. May the Force be with you. Bye!